Welcome guys to the start of the unique weapons and hard to find weapons part. Now I reckon this one will be much harder. Now this is a light in shining darkness. This is an honest hearts gun and it's very difficult to come by. You have to complete the whole of honest hearts to get given it. It's a nice gun. It's very nice. It is a... I can't remember what type of pistol it is. It's a pistol though. And I love the guns in this game. They look so much better, and they're so much better texturized. And this is actually just like the original, just it's got a different grip, and it's got writing on it. It's actually very good for just a pistol. Right, we got to find somewhere next to go. Uh, let's think. What is the Prim Pass? I'm trying to think of somewhere where we'll get to fight. I'll go from the Nipton Road rest, rest stop and see what we can find. Now I'm enjoying making these videos but I've kind of got a bit slow on them I know because just because I've been a bit busy recently. I've got homework I'm doing for art and that's kind of slow and boring so I've been doing quite a bit of that. And I've been playing a lot of this game this summer most of the time. It's really enjoyable. It's nice to get the DLC. I got it for £10 in game. It's a great price for such a great game so anyway. There's usually scorpions around here. Head up. Scorpions. Scorpions are actually quite strong in this game. Bloody hell. It's good I have teammates, it really is. No, I also want you to wait here as well, you little shit. Run from me. No. He's alive! People trying to steal my kills. They will just stand their ground and get themselves killed. I reckon this used to be a small camp. Uh, no. What's the point of having a footlocker if it's empty? Why do games do that to people? A camp was ridiculous anyway. Wait a sec. Brilliant gun, absolutely brilliant. Let's switch to the next. This is found in one of the vaults. Now, I haven't really done much to it. It's a unique gun. It fires green, yet it's a laser rifle. So... Take a look at that. It's actually pretty crappy. Yeah, this gun's pretty bad, especially against these. Oh, that took a lot of killing. 
and it's got the old aiming, so you can't actually aim down the sights on this gun, which is ridiculous. They should have made all guns be able to be aimed like that, but they didn't. It's ridiculous. But it's still a damn good gun. Let's just stick with that. I'm kind of just following the enemy dots now. Because I kind of want to put up a fight. Right. I won't die. I've got like the best armor in the game. So it should, should be easy to kill these things. If it's not, it's got hardly any ammo and it does no damage whatsoever. So I'm going to switch straight away. Straight out. Switch guns. This. The most powerful gun in the game. Still got the bad aiming, but it was in Fallout 3 as well, and it's amazing. It's one of my favourite guns in the game, like, ever. For definite. There's just no doubt about it. Where are we? We should be heading that way. Now, it, it may have the old aiming, but it's definitely not and change to be easier to break or less dangerous it's still probably the most da dangerous gun in the game I really got ah, there we go, w watch this it's not even hitting them there you go don't need to really show much else that this gun can do Switch to the next rare gun in the game. The All American. A military looking gun. It is crazy and cool. It's actually a marksman carbine, which I really like. It's got a cool scope. Fires one bullet at a time, but you can speed it however you like. Uh, where is my team? Wait, 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 wait a second. A few bullets, job done. This one is also found in the same vault you find the LEAR or the AER 14. And then this video is definitely going to be taken up. Some more. This actually looks pretty damn cool. I think that's pretty much all you need to see from this gun. Why? Why is everything gone black and white? That was weird. But pretty damn cool. Right, I never knew this was here. I should have come better equipped. I don't have it with me. I can't really come here. that gun being shown off for now because I'm not coming back yet. I'm going to come back to this one in a minute. This will be the all of the videos for today though in a minute because I kind of want to get on with my own game. I need to head back to EDE or Eddie and boom. So to the next rare gun. Next rare gun on the list is 
Elijah, his advanced LEAR. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, LAER. This gun has it all. It's crazy. I love this gun. It's a unique gun. You can only get it with the Old World Blues DLC. Absolutely amazing gun. So, don't really need me to explain how damn good this gun is. Next gun on the list is the my favourite gun of all time here, the pretty much new texture for a sniper, and I way prefer it. It looks gold. It looks so damn cool. Oh, what a kill. See, I love this gun. It is. The hell is that? It's like a glitch. Some of the glitches in this game are just odd. There you go. Go in. Go in. It's got good accuracy. Damn good accuracy. Yeah. yeah, all right. Let's have a little look. This isn't exactly a unique weapon. It's the nail gun. These things have been really toughened up in this game, though, aren't they? Oh, I didn't realise it's got like automated. Oh, it's got automated fire now. That is badass. Um, I was trying to head out to my team, but got interrupted by ghouls. Now I bet that looks really bad in your arm. It's just got the animation of one nail. That doesn't even work. I'm just gonna do something. There he is. Did I miss him? Got him. <laughs> just thought I'd finish off with that pretty much. And we'll continue this episode next time. Because the next episode is gonna include the K900 Cyberdog gun. This is in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. See you soon. Bye.